John. So, a bill requiring the DNI to declassify the COVID origins intel passed the Senate. If it passes the House, too, would President Biden sign it? Oh, watch Peter Ducey throw this tasty piece of bait out into the water for John Kirby to go after. Would President Biden sign it? I won't get ahead of the president's decision making, um, uh, Peter, but uh, look, we. A couple of things to keep in mind. Right after taking office, the president declassified uh, and had and made public the DNI's uh, initial findings here about the source of, of COVID. So he already very swiftly and unilaterally put information out there. That's one. Two, the intelligence community continues to assess the origins of COVID. I know I've seen press reporting about some preliminary findings that, of a classified nature. You can see Kirby struggling with this because he knows what setup is coming. If the lab leak is the actual origin for the coronavirus, this starts to make the connection to the gain-of-function research supported by we-know-who, Dr. Fauci, and the resulting deaths in the U.S. But there's still no consensus. Um, and that's why the president has directed the team to stay at the work, because he wants to know. He wants to know as best we can know what the origins were so that we can work to better prevent a future pandemic. But we've got the FBI director saying most likely a potential lab incident in Wuhan. Yeah. If, if a foreign yeah. country came to the United States and killed 1.1 million Americans with guns, would the president just let that slide? Nobody's letting anything slide. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Woo! Look at that, guys. Check that out.